One of the most striking things about philosophy in Sheffield is the flexibility offered by the department. We don't have any compulsory philosophy modules, so students can choose freely across a very wide range of modules. For me it was the flexibility of the course. Uh, given that they're all unrestricted modules, I have friends who are still doing philosophy, but because they choose different modules to me, they're doing a completely different degree, um, which I think is great. Sheffield's fantastic because the lecturers are really friendly um, and they're all really approachable and there's loads of different ways to get involved apart from your lectures. There's the Philosophy Society, there's Philosophy in the City, there's the Departmental Seminar um, and there's a new undergraduate philosophy journal, Phil and House, which was set up by myself and a couple of other students last year which was really exciting. I enjoy wandering about the world and I think philosophy gives me the chance to grapple with some questions that have been puzzling humankind for thousands of years. I think Aristotle was right when he said that philosophy begins with a sense of wonder. The kind of students we're looking for are people who find something intriguing and exciting about apparently common features of the everyday world. For example, that we're physical objects but that we have feelings or that we care about what's right and what's wrong. What's exciting for me in general is the way that philosophy affects your life, uh, even when you don't realise it, uh, from the kind of the, your outlook to the way you're governed, it all kind of has some philosophical grounding. Since starting university I feel like I've gained really key and valuable skills. I can critically assess an argument, I can really listen to people uh, and understand their opinion and I feel like I've gained a lot of confidence and I'm not afraid to voice my opinion. These skills I feel will be really valuable to me in the future. Philosophy gives you an important set of transferable skills. Reading carefully, thinking through complex material, uh, thinking through a case, an argument, spotting weaknesses and so on. That's why it's excellent preparation for a wide range of jobs. I think writing critically, writing essays, writing exams, all of those things have helped improve my own communication skills, uh, whether it's writing an email to a client or kind of thinking about projects and writing grant applications and things like that. Um, I think that those skills are something that philosophy taught me and that I was able to directly transfer into my career post-university. If I had to choose two words to say what I look for in an applicant, they'd be clarity and enthusiasm. Our philosophy degree doesn't have any specific subject requirements, but it's very likely that in A-levels or international baccalaureate or college courses you'll have done, you'll have touched upon subjects which are philosophically interesting. If you can mention one of those in your UCAS application, that'd be a great idea.